thank you for stopping by. This is my first video. I hope to continue these, but we'll just stick with this one for now. I was inspired by Wendy's journal adventures. I will put the link down below. Uh, the 7th of September she did a Christmas greeting card where she recycled it into a beautiful junk journal folder. This is my version. I have changed it a bit. Um, when you, If you look at Wendy's you'll see she left the front as a Christmas card. I've obviously changed mine and just added the paper. So I'll just explain what I did. I've used an old greeting card and on the front I've just put some vintage music paper. I've then put a fabric strip just down the side. Printed off, I think this was Tsunami Rose, a little um, library card. Put a little cluster together, a bit of cheesecloth, lace, wallpapers just to make a little cluster. And sewn round the edge. Inside there's just two book pages that I've folded. This was using Patricia Viramontes. I'll also link her down below uh, as an idea. There's a tuck spot here, tuck spots here, tuck spot here and a tuck spot here. This is actually going to go to a friend and um, it's for a good friend who loves to read so that's why it's quite a book theme and this will be for her to store her bookmarks in which I'm also going to be making her. This is just a little library card that I've printed off. This was Artie Mays. I've just lined the inside of the greeting card with various old papers, some square paper, some coffee dyed paper, and I've put coffee dyed paper strip down the middle, and obviously I've inked all the edges, and again, things have been sewn on the machine. On the back page, again, I just covered the greeting card with music paper. It's obviously the back of the fabric strip. I made another little cluster here from lace, paper, button. A uh, little printable, again, that was Artie Mays. I will link that down below as well. And then it's just ready, really, for the bookmarks to go in. Well, I hope you've enjoyed my little video. I hope to make others. I'm always inspired by all the lovely people on YouTube. And until next time... Thanks for stopping by. Bye-bye.